I now just got a piece of information in my ear that how long has he been in the job, Scaramucci? The Mooch has been in the job like a week and, and week and some change. He has just resigned from his position as director of communications. Uh, this was someone who, let me just, I'm surprised. Let me just be real with you. Um, this is someone who took the job. Remember, Sean Spicer ended up deciding to resign. Uh, we know what's happened in the uh, New Yorker interview, the, the profanity-laced New York interview with Ryan Lizza uh, that Scaramucci did just a couple of days ago uh, when he was talking, speaking ill, not only about Reince Priebus, but also about Steve Bannon. This is extraordinarily significant. We're, we're getting some folks who are going to jump on set to, to go through this breaking news that Scaramucci has resigned. Caitlin Collins is at the White House. Caitlin, what? How did this happen? Um, there's a lot of news coming out right now. Brooke, we have heard that Anthony Scaramucci, the communications director who was named communications director just last Friday, has been removed from his position. We don't have a lot of details right now, but we do know that there have, there's been a lot of drama since he was brought into this position. We saw Press Secretary Sean Spicer resign in protest over him being named to this position. And then we saw the chief of staff, Reince Priebus, ousted last week over the over all of this drama that's been going on as you know there was that anthony scaramucci interview where he blasted reince Priebus and accused him of being a leaker of white house information so it's safe to say there's been a lot of drama coming out of the scaramucci being appointed to this position and we're likely going to find out more over the next few minutes about what happened with scaramucci being removed from this position